Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Monday. The kids are already at school. I woke up late today. Not not on accident though, on purpose. Um, I stayed in bed a little longer. I got up at 7.30 because I went to sleep so late last night. I went to sleep at like 11, like 11.30. So I went to sleep really, really late. Um, and look, I have my coffee that I brewed yesterday. I saved it. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna have some iced coffee. And then I'm gonna try that steel oat steel cut oatmeal with quinoa I'm gonna try that and see if that's any good okay here it is it doesn't look as pretty as the box but it smells really really good it's so weird being home all alone normally my mom is here with me or Ariel's here with me but Ariel already went to work it's 11 o'clock I've just been doing laundry. I had to catch up on laundry because I didn't do any laundry this weekend. And then for dinner tonight, I was gonna make that frozen lasagna that we bought yesterday. But I was thinking that when my dad comes home from work, so my dad has two jobs. My dad works like the whole weekend. And then my dad goes to like his regular job um, at night. He works at the casino with my mom. So my dad has work again tonight at the casino. So when my dad comes home from the second job, He's not going to have anything to eat because normally my mom would cook. Uh, so I was thinking that I should probably put the lasagna in the oven now. It's going to take like two hours to heat up. So I don't, I don't even know if my dad's going to eat this lasagna. My dad just probably might eat something with rice because we do have rice. But I didn't cook anything. <laughs> so I don't know. He could, eat, he could eat something, canned food or something. I don't know. Maybe he'll eat the lasagna. But I gotta go back to work. And yeah. Actually, I realized we have corned beef. So I can cook corned beef for my dad. Because I know my dad prefers to eat rice. Uh, like Filipino food. So I'm gonna saute up the corned beef like a Filipino style. So it's just canned corned beef. It looks like this. It looks like that. Oh, you guys couldn't see, sorry. This is the one that we like. Oh, it's from Australia. I had no idea. And then I just cooked that with tomatoes, onions, and garlic. Let me make sure I have all of those things. I hope we have tomatoes. Yes, we have tomatoes and we always, oh, actually I can use that leftover onion. We always have onions and garlic. Yes, okay, so I'll cook that on my lunch break. I just um, spoke to my mom and she's still not coming home and I just feel really bad because she's all alone and I, I can't I can't be there with her because I have to work and I don't know how long she's gonna be there probably I don't know they gave her some um, new medicine and they just want to monitor her, so she's gonna be there probably a couple, a couple more days. But I'm just like really sad for her, and um, I just wish that you guys can pray for her, um, so she can come home and be okay. Okay, sorry about that, you guys. Um, I feel a lot better. I think that. I haven't cried. I actually haven't like I've been holding in all my feelings these these past few days And so it kind of just really got to me when I talked to my mom on the phone today just now So now that I I've cried it out. I think I feel I f I'm feeling a lot better And I just want to explain a little bit more what's happening So she has atrial fibrillation which she's been taking medication for for a while now But today the specialist came to see her and changed her meds took her off the other ones um, and they just want to monitor her for today and tomorrow and see how she does on that new medication and then he also wants her to come in for a procedure next time um, where they like shock her heart for 10 minutes she says but that'll be helpful because um she won't have to be on blood thinners anymore and then I, I guess it's for her atrial fibrillation i'm not really too sure but um so that's what's happening with her right now so she's just in there right now being monitored and she does feel better and i just want her to come home already okay i'm on lunch break and i'm gonna cook the corned beef so i have one tomato half an onion and it's like four or five cloves of garlic that i just diced up really small 
and then I'm just gonna saute that all together and you don't have to add any seasoning it's already it's gonna be good you don't have to add anything special watching one of my favorite movies, Legally Blonde, it's on Netflix. While I have my lunch, this is the final product, uh, corned beef and a little bit of rice, and it's really, really good. Mango, so sweet. Okay, the kitchen is all cleaned. Oh, the oven is beeping at me. The kitchen's all cleaned up, got all the dishes put away. It looks so nice and clean. Okay, and now I have to remove the foil. Let me get something to pull that off with remove the foil lid and then just have to bake it for 15 more minutes so the cheese on top can melt. Look at that. That looks delicious and it smells good too. I'm feeling very accomplished today. I've got some laundry folded already. I have one more load in the dryer and then one more load in the washing machine which is the kids clothes. Then I'll be all done with laundry. OMG look what just came in the mail. Magic bands. Wow, these are so cool. We've never had magic bands before, so this is our first time having them, and they're so cool. Wow. It's dinner time, and we're all going to have some lasagna. It looks so delicious, and it smells good, too. Ooh, looks good as well. Look at that. We just are, we just are. <laughs> we're just about to leave the hospital, or I guess we're already leaving. There's the hospital. Ooh, it's cold and I wanted to walk down this pathway because it looked so pretty with all these like flowers and stuff and bushes oh, no whoa way. what right here oh there is no way out what the heck no we have to go this way and then go around how weird and the parking lot is right there oh my gosh it's so cold first one to the car is a winner wait I changed my mind first one to the car is a loser <laughs> so she comes back. Third person to the car is a winner. Second person to the car is a winner. <laughs> okay, whoever has the key is a winner. That's me. No! <laughs> oh my god, it's so cold. Boy wins. What? Whoever is a good looking boy wins. Aw man, I'm not a boy. Hey, I, I am good looking. What are you trying to do? One pack? Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're so funny. Are we going to sleep now? Yeah, I'm going to go to sleep now. Okay. Oh, I couldn't even see you. Fail. Fail? Yeah. Fail. I'm going to sleep, it's 10.30, and tomorrow the kids want me to make them some waffles for breakfast, so I have to wake up early for that. Waffles? The frozen waffles? Because AJ wanted it this morning, but I didn't wake up, and he doesn't know how to toast it in the toaster oven. Like, because you know we don't have a regular toaster, so he can't just... He did it one time, but I think he's like kind of scared because he might burn his hand. He has to use the tongs, and he's kind of afraid of tongs. Because <laughs> when he was small, I used to always pinch him with the tongs. <laughs> so he's like traumatized now from tongs. Wow. See what you did? <laughs> He'll be okay. He'll grow out. He'll grow out of it. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to go to sleep now and we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye. Bye.